friends, karibuni tena katika channel yangu na mimi naitwa Ikairi Mrema na kama bado je subscribe please bonyeza hiyo button ilo andikwa subscribe na hapo pembeni ya subscribe pana kikengele bonyeza hicho kikengele hapo pembeni ili uweze kupata notification kwenye kila video nitakayo post utakuwa wa kwanza kupata notification so leo nimekuja na video ambayo nitaenda kuongelea vitu vitano ambavyo kila msichana lazima avijue of course tunaweza tukawa tunavijua vitu lakini kuna vile main and important thing ambavyo every girl must know or should know so nikaamua ni share na nyinyi vitu ambavyo mimi navijua ambavyo mimi kama msichana ninavijua na nataka na wewe huweza kuvielewa so sisi wasichana tumekuwa tuna vitu ambavyo vinaweza vikatupa hamasa ya kufanya vitu na vitu ambavyo vinaweza vikatupa <sighs> like vitu ambavyo vinaweza vikatufanya tusiweze kuendelea kufanya vitu kitu cha kwanza kitu cha kwanza lazima ujue you are beautiful yes you are so lazima ujikubali kama wewe ni mzuri no matter what usijali chochote mtu anachosema wewe ni mzuri jinsi ulivyo so kuji accept wewe mwenyewe kunaweza kukakupa confidence ya wewe kuendelea haijarishi nani anasema nini haijarishi fulani yukoje haijarishi nani yukoje kila mtu ameumbwa kwa mfano wa Mungu so juu kwamba wewe you are special na mbele za watu wewe unaonekana mzuri haijalishi fulani anakonaje na mbele za Mungu especially wewe ni wa thamani sana kuliko chochote so ni lazima tujikubali kwamba sisi ni wazuri kwa jinsi tulivyo hivi vitu vingine vya dunia vya kujiongezea uzuri ni just exceptional lakini we are beautiful inside and out so nikija kitu cha pili ambacho kila msichana lazima ajue kwanza inabidi ujue thamani yako popote pale usiweze kuishusha thamani yako iwe kwa pesa iwe kwa upenzi ama upendo iwe kwa chochote kile lazima ujue you are worth thamani yako iwe ya kwanza chochote kile kisiwezi kikachukua utu wako kwa sababu tu ni kitu utu wako unakuja mbele baada ya kitu chochote kile so you must know that you are worth na ni lazima wewe kama msichana utunze thamani yako mbele za watu like everybody akuone kwamba <coughs> you know you are worth kwamba mtu fulani ni wa thamani iwe kwenye familia iwe kwa marafiki iwe katika mahusiano iwe katika jamii lazima ujue kwamba mimi ni wa thamani na ninahitaji kuthaminika mbele za macho ya watu so popote pale unapoona kwamba thamani yako inashuka you must act on that yani ni lazima u act usikae tu like it's fine it's not fine yani wewe si wa bei rahisi ama wewe si uchukuliwi you 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 are worth in every sector so lazima ujue thamani yako kwanza so kitu cha tatu ambacho kila msichana lazima ajue ni kwamba you are important yani wewe ni wa muhimu na unahitajika sana iwe in every sector kwenye kila sehemu ujue kwamba you are very important kwamba bila wewe kuna vitu ambavyo visingeweza kufanyika bila wewe kuna vitu ambavyo visingeweza kuendelea so jua kwamba wewe unahitajika yani wewe ni wa muhimu sana achana na kwamba mimi ni thamani lakini wewe pia ni wa muhimu without you kuna vitu ambavyo visingeenda sawa so ni lazima tujue kwamba sisi we are very important especially kwa sisi wanawake tukiingia kwenye sekta ya um, malezi kwamba sisi ni mama nyumbani sisi ni dada sisi ni watoto so kuna vile vitu ambavyo lazima jamii familia ndugu jamaa mahusiano wanatuhitaji so hawezi mtu hawezi kuwa kwenye mahusiano without you of course tuachane na haya mahusiano sasa hivi ya jinsi ya moja mahusiano tunayojua in general lazima kutokuwe na mwanamke na mwanaume 
so you know that you're important lazima kuwe na mama so lazima unahitajika wewe ni wa muhimu kuwa mama so so tunaweza tukajiona kwamba sisi hatuhitajiki labda katika jamii lakini mwanamke ni kiungo kikubwa sana kwenye jamii na unahitajika sana 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 asilimia nyingi sana unahitajika kwenye jamii kwenye kila sekta wewe unahitajika so don't downfall yourself usijishusha thamani usijione kwamba sio mzuri usijione kwamba hauhitajiki jua kwamba unahitajika sana so kitu cha nne ambacho kila mwanamke anakijua don't compare yourself usijifananishe na chochote na yoyote you are the way you are yani wewe jinsi ulivyo ndio you are unique in that way so mimi ni Haeli siwezi kujifananisha na Jennifer ama kujifananisha sijui na Zuhura sijui na Salome sijui na Uteva no <laughs> mimi nilivyo ni unique in my own way so kuna vile vitu ambavyo Zuhura Jennifer Salome yoyote hawezi kuwa navyo mimi ninavyo na ni very important na ni very unique kwangu mimi. So, don't compare yourself kwamba fulani anafanya hivi na mimi nikifanya hivi nitakuwa kama fulani. No, unaweza ukafanya kama anavyofanya fulani na usiwe kama yeye. So, wewe unachokifanya ni muhimu. Na fulani anachokifanya ni muhimu kwa yeye na kwa wewe. So, usijiput in other people's position. Be in your own position. Unaona? And utakuwa unique in your own way. So usitake zula wa pili. Taka aika wa kwanza. Unaona eh? So ya yeah, kwamba usijikompe na mtu mwingine yoyote yule. So tuna tuna ni vizuri ku ku iga mafanikio ya watu na kufata lakini sio completely usichukua kitu cha mtu completely ukawa kama yeye completely no honey so we need something new and you are the one to give us something new yeah kitu cha mwisho ni explore yourself live your best life love eh? so fanya kile unachoweza kukifanya kwa muda huo with all your heart just explore yourself live your best life eh usifanye kwa sababu fulani kiniona oh my god atafikiriaje no you are the way you are fulani akikuona that is none of your business so kwa muda uliokuwa nao just enjoy your time kwa umri uliokuwa nao just enjoy your time kila umri una vitu vyako vya kufanya so unaweza ukaa katika umri fulani ukashindwa kufanya vitu fulani na ukafika umifani ukavijutia kwa nini sikuvifanya so kama kitu ambacho is not illegal na hakiwezi kukuletea matatizo yoyote so if it's in a position positive way just do it and you will love the life so kitu kingine just love usiogope kupenda penda jipende na utapendwa so love yourself love others and you'll be loved na usiache ku live your best life that is the only important thing kuna sometimes you will regret kwamba kwa nini ule muda nilitumia vibaya ama kwa nini ule muda sikufanya kitu fulani so usifikie sehemu ya kuweza ku regret kwa nini sikufanya hivi ni vizuri kutumia muda sahihi huo leo nao kwa kitu sahihi ambacho one day utasema ya yeah, that was my time na nilitumia effectively so that's all i have to share with you guys i know ni kitu ambacho nimekurupuka tu it's just come into my mind and i kasema nitakifanyia video so i didn't plan it for the long time sikujiandaa so, sana lakini it's something that come into my mind and say i will just do a video about it so yes thank you guys for watching this video and <laughs> don't forget to subscribe and like yeah and don't forget to place the ring 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 bell bell button there so that you can get notification every time that i posted a video you'll be the first one to know that i posted a video okay 
Yes. So, meet our on a quick video.